some Snowball Onion Sets some Sensu Sensu and some electric red ones I do have some red barren seeds for onions that I'm going to set away at home um, but then one of the beds when sweet corn's gone we'll probably put them in there when they're ready but we're going to put some of these in this bed now So here we were cutting some more of the blue tube and so it will put some netting over the top of the onions. However, I miscalculated how big that needed to be and you can see it's far too big. So we had to scrap that idea, pull these two up because we didn't have a piece the same size as that and we used smaller ones. So there's a bed just there on the left. Uh, we used those two and there was another piece around the back. So fastened some bamboo across the top with some twine. And that made it a bit more sturdy. The blue pipes have got metal pipes in um, the bed, so they're like quite far down and, and quite sturdy anyway. Once the netting was over the top, it's really hard to do anything at the back, so I had to start at the front. I secured it with two tie wraps, made sure it was nice and neat and tight and, and where it should be round, like pulled around the sides, and then I started that at the back, secured that in place with a couple of plastic stakes, and then I did the same at the front again, pulling it around so it's nice and tight and neat. And then I put a couple of clips on just so it, you know, nothing could get underneath, um, but just so it was it was nice and secure. <laughs> I did pull one of them back and it was milky inside and they're really dark brown um, but because I didn't label them I don't know what's normal sweet corn or mini sweet corn so we're just going to have a go and see what it comes out like. <laughs> Learn the knack of how to get them open quicker. You never learn, don't you? 